The Ramones Way. That's quite an unusual name for a street, isn't it? Today we are in Forest Hills, New York, at the site of the Forest Hills High School. Established in 1937, the high school building was finished by 1941. Its dedication ceremony was attended by Mayor LaGuardia. From the beginning, the school excelled in the science program. However, aside from academics, the school has also produced a wealth of famous people who are known all over the world. This is what the video is about today. The famous alumni who once attended Forest Hills High School. Now I'm not going to physically name every single person, but I will talk about a few of them. And then for everyone else, I will continue to add photos throughout the video so that you can see the variety of famous people who once attended Forest Hills High School. Of course, right at the very start of the video, you got a little hint towards four of the famous alumni who once attended the school. John Cummins, Thomas Erdelli, Douglas Colvin and Jeffrey Hyman, who collectively became known as Johnny, Tommy, Dee Dee and Joey Ramone. The pioneers of punk rock music. The Ramones. Though they were in different years at Forest Hills High, they did all attend the school at the same time. However, the Ramones were formed several years after all four had left the school. In a housing project nearby, there is a mural painted for the band from the ramp where they all used to hang out. I had actually filmed this mural as part of a different video, but I decided to extract the clip and add it to this video, as I think that the mural will fit better here. The Ramones are not the only famous people to have attended Forest Hills High School, though. Not by a long shot. In fact, I would probably take a guess that the most famous duo to have attended the school, certainly in the terms of being known to people all around the world, would be the duo Simon and Garfunkel. The duo had actually met and performed before they even attended Forest Hills High School. First when they were 11 years old, and they both appeared in the school production of Alice in Wonderland. And when they were in junior high, they were performing as the Peptones with three friends. After they moved to Forest Hills High, they wrote the song, Hey Schoolgirl, and at 16 years old, they had their first chart success when Hey Schoolgirl reached number 49 on the Billboard charts, with them recording under the names of Tom and Jerry. After they graduated high school in 1958, both singers left for different colleges. They reunited after they had graduated college five years later in 1963. And that is when the career of one of the most famous duos to ever record began their 50 years plus journey.
It is a strange coincidence that when Simon and Garfunkel were seniors, starting in 1957 at Forest Hills High School, a freshman also arrived at the high school in 1957, who would later become known for a different genre of television programming in the mid-1990s. Jerry Springer, from the sensationalized television program The Jerry Springer Show, was attending Forest Hills at the same time that Simon and Garfunkel were there as well. I couldn't possibly think of a lower form of entertainment than the Jerry Springer show. However, his show was wildly popular in the ratings, and literally everyone in America at the time knew of the program. Here is a little bit of trivia for you to enjoy as well. Jerry Springer was born in 1944 in the Highgate Underground subway station in London. His parents were German Jews who had escaped from Poland, and Jerry was born while his parents were taking shelter at the station, which had been converted into an air raid shelter at the time. This video footage is nowhere near long enough for me to give individual mentions to all of the famous alumni. So from here until the end of the video, I will add images along the way to show you the famous people who once attended Forest Hills High School. One additional mention before I do that though, goes to Captain Kangaroo, Bob Keeshan. One of the earliest graduates of Forest Hills High, Bob went on to first have various television jobs playing a clown in children's programming before developing the character of Captain Kangaroo in 1955. For the next 30 years, he performed as the character in his highly successful show. Before we wrap up the video by me showing you the images of all of the famous people who once attended Forest Hills High School, let me tell you about someone who didn't go to this school. I am talking about Peter Parker, also known as Spider-Man. The fictional character went to Midtown High School, as did dozens of the other characters from the Spider-Man series of comic books. And just a little bit of trivia for you, the creation of Midtown High School was modelled upon Forest Hills High School in Queens. The character of Peter Parker actually resided in Forest Hills. Just figured I would share that little nugget with you. Anyway, enjoy the rest of the video and see how many of the famous alumni that I am about to add that you already know of. They come from all fields of life and from every decade, dating back to the 1940s. There are some references online that both Ray Romano and Michael Landon also attended Forest Hills High, but I don't believe that to be true. It is true that both were born in Forest Hills, Queens, but my research has shown that neither attended Forest Hills High. By the way, the likes on my videos have been tanking lately. So if you enjoy the video, would you consider hitting the like button for me? My goal is to always shoot for 30 likes, and I've been falling way short of that lately. As I'm sure you are all aware, Clicking the like button always helps the channel out. Anyway, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Let me know how many of the famous alumni from Forest Hills High School that you recognize in the comment section down below. Peace out, and I will catch you all real soon.